Welcome in Knitting in My Wishes, where I will talk about knitting, yarn and my crafty uh, life. But on the beginning of the movie I am showing you a beautiful beach of Bonbeuf, which is in the north of Mauritius Island. Beautiful sand, sea of the ocean, uh, Condemir Island, right now you can see there. And um, yeah, the beach is just fantastic. You can um, see the volcanic rocks and a beautiful blue sky. Just enjoy the little tour around <laughs> my wishes, around the beach. And I welcome you in my podcast. Hope you like it and hope you will come back. Uh, thank you very much for watching and just let's go to the knitting. Um, Bye, see you just now. Good morning and welcome in Knitting in Mauritius. My name is Anna, I'm living in Mauritius, knitting and trying to avoid uh, COVID virus. <laughs> As I, in last uh, podcast, I was telling you that uh, the country is open for tourists since 18th of October. And since uh, then we have more people coming. Of course, they're all having a COVID test before arriving and uh, before leaving the country. Uh, but we still Still got this variant in the country as as far I know, um, and we have about three thousand cases now per weekend. Sometimes in the day, uh, the hospitals are full with uh, with COVID case uh, ho uh, sick people, and uh, it is a big problem for the country. So schools are closed again. Uh, luckily, the beaches are open so we can walk, we can go uh, and have a walk after uh, online lessons with the boys. And, uh, but otherwise we're not really mixing with people. We don't really um, go for dinners, lunches. Uh, we're not really inviting even friends home. Uh, you don't know where, how the people are, uh, are and uh, with whom they are, who they met and uh, if they, well or not well. So we're trying to avoid uh, as much contact with uh, people as possible. I'm ordering again online all fruits, vegetables and grocery stuff. Life is not so easy. We are on a small island. We're having an, uh, limited um, uh, hospitals and limited uh, medical care. And it's not so really easy when uh, it's coming to the COVID because it's really a lot of cases right now. But anyway, schools are online, kids are at home, um, internet is uh, switching on and off, uh, so mom has to be permanently with them and uh, helping with uh, internet, helping with connection. Uh, they are frustrated sometimes. They, I believe the teachers are also frustrated. Everybody is frustrated, <laughs> but we have to go through. We will go through uh, like this to the end of the uh, first term uh, before Christmas. Then will be one month break for Christmas and second term. Let's see what will be in January. Let's take the best out of everything and take day by day all the life. I would like to show you what I needed in the meantime. Uh, in two days, it's a birthday of my friend, uh, the godmother to my uh, to my uh, big son, and I needed for her, of course, ranunculus. So this is her ranunculus. It's knitted in a. It's very see-through. It's very light. It's uh, the uh, big uh, neck version, uh, and it's very uh, um, airy. So it is made out of, I didn't make long sleeves because I think it's very airy. She will put it on, on top of some bikini or dress or she is a Chinese uh, uh, origin. And uh, 
she's Chinese cultured. <laughs> I'm sorry. And um, the red is the color. I think she will love it. She doesn't know. I didn't put pictures now on Instagram. I will do it to, in two days when I will uh, uh, give to her first. I hope she will put also her uh, product uh, on herself and, and she will post on Instagram. I hope she will be happy. I needed it with uh, uh, very quickly and I didn't show you in the last uh, podcast because it's, I mean, now the Christmas time, the uh, it's coming. So now I'm concentrating really on gifts. I needed already um, three already. Uh, um Renicolas, one for me, one for my mom, which I will show you just now, and one for my friend Mary. Uh, and three more are online for my secretary who do a lot of things for me uh, and help me uh, for um um for whom? Ah, for my best friend. <laughs> for my best friend. She's really tiny and I have to find out uh, the sizes and one i'm knitting for my sister which is here and i will just tell you it's nearly finished so um this one i needed in this beautiful cotton i think you say suave suave cotton is by pasquale filati i will show you here it is amazing uh, yarn look how fluffy it is it's not like really cotton i mean it's it it is so fluffy, like some kind of, uh, I don't know, um, maybe, maybe I will say Suri Alpaca, which is not brushed. Really, really, really soft and really, it's amazing. It's not um, at all um, hard or worked over, I think, like a like lot of uh, cotton is. So it was, I mean, it was a work for me, this pullover. I um, I must say, I don't like to knit with uh, cotton. It's not moving on my needle so fast. And this, because this was so fluffy, it was even uh, less, uh, less comfortable. But three days and it is done. So this is amazing. It's my eyes. It's my opinion. It's amazing. Light pullover. Not pullover, so over, I would say. Um... For my uh for my friend mary mary happy birthday when you watch this um and pity we cannot ha have celebration um like we always did but maybe next year i hope next year so i will show you this is for my uh friend mary the one for me and for my mom you saw it before yes you saw it Yes, you saw it before. And now I will show you the one which I'm working for my sister. I will show you now because um, I don't think I, I will have it for next uh, podcast. I'm trying to send it very, very quickly. So I will show you. This will be a ranunculus for my sister. The uh, sleeve is still missing. It's not done to the end. The, one, the left one, the right one is made. It's a long sleeve. The stripes become bigger, of course, because the circumstances is uh, smaller. So uh, this uh, self-striping yarn uh, made different effect on the sleeve. I made one by one rip here and uh, and the Judy um, cast, uh, magic cast off, uh, bind off. And uh, this will be a, a ranunculus for my sister. She's already waiting, waiting, waiting. So this is the ranunculus number four. Four <laughs> in a short time, in a very short time. Um, so I will show you some wools later for for. I don't know. My mom's pullover is also here, so I will just show you. So this one I needed in this yarn. Uh, this yarn, oops, it uh, looks beautiful. I will just uh, show you the. Ah, where it is now? Hopla, it was here. Yes, long me, long me colori baby. This is the etiquette. This is the yarn, self striping. It's just amazing. In a color way, three five seven two. So it is a oh, it's a hundred percent merino wool. 
when you're starting to knit with it, you think, oh, this is so thin, like a fingering, like a very fi thin fingering. When you're knitting with it, it is immediately blowing. It is just getting bigger and bigger. So this pullover, instead of being very light, it will be warm pullover. That's why I made the sleeves, long sleeves, that she can wear it in the winter time. And um, I, on the beginning, I was thinking it will be very thin pullover, but no, I started to knit. Look how this yarn changed, how it's uh, blowing already, opening, it's fuzzy. And so 100% uh, merino, very beautiful uh, wool. And I'm holding together with a, a silk mohair from uh, the blue color. From Hasegawa, this is my last one, so I don't have the uh, close one. It's the name Hasegawa, and the color name is Suave. Um, Suave, no, no, no. I will write here. I will put here the name of the yarn and in down below in the uh, comments. Uh, so this is um, Virgin uh, Virgin uh, Merino. Fine Virgin Merino, beautiful yarn beautiful work i was having this yarn for some time i took it from my stash my sister like colorful uh, clothes and i put it on the side and i never was really going into this yarn i never was really liking the yarn because it was so so thin when you take in your hand but when you're starting to work with it i mean it's just the amazing piece the last i didn't show you last time i think i show you in progress but now it is ready so this is the ranunculus for my mom yes so this is the what this is the front or the back i don't know now so this is the ranunculus for my mom and yes and i will put it on and i will come back just a second hello again uh, I put just now on the ranunculus for my man. It is made this way. It is, uh, I mean, the pattern I just keep like it is. Only what I uh, did here, I mean, actually, I did also the same uh, short rows on the sleeves, like it is um, in a pattern. And here I finished. Um, uh, bind off with uh, eye cut and <clears throat> I did it this um, my mom is a bit shorter smaller so I think the length will be up to here for her um, I like this finish very much it is universal for many uh, type of weather and it's lighter than the one for my sister um, it is made out of the urban pearl yarn that's the color and uh, i uh, was holding together with um with the hasegawa hasegawa the seika color it's so light green so it was together like this i don't have any more of this uh, mohair silk mohair from hasegawa this is the uh, yarn I got it from uh, Steven and Penelope. The um, name of the color is Persephone and it's 80% uh, merino, 20% silk. Uh, in 100 grams is 365 meters. Um, I did the longer sleeves, so I needed to open the second. Um, um, a bo uh, skin of the yarn and uh, I used nearly two of the Hasegawa silk mohair and I used one and a bit of this uh, uh, urban pearl yarn uh, because I needed my mom wanted to have longer so it's not that crop like normally uh, um, ranunculus is a longer sleeves so I needed more yarn um, I love it very much. 
and I hope my mom would be very happy with it. Uh, there is no much more another uh, changes into the pattern. Um, yes, so I would like to, uh, uh, for, for my sister pullover, uh, I wanted to make this combination first, what I was telling you, this one, this yarn and this yarn. I mean, it is done, yeah, this one and this one, but finally I don't do this. Uh, and then I was thinking to make this yarn and this one, but I just decided to make the uh, sip striping yarn. So a lot of different decisions, but uh, yeah, it's good to make the mine. And I think when you're working, when you're knitting, you see and you think about the person you're doing it for, I think you can see um, how the person will look and how the person will feel in this uh, garment. I think it's better this self-striping yarn for my sister and it's one nice pullover. Um, yes, so what I would like to tell you, I would like to show you some of my, I, I, I my podcasts are always a bit chaotic. <laughs> I know, I'm sorry. I would like to show you one of my purchase. Oh, I have one more. I have my uh, one more finished product, sorry. I got this yarn from uh, Rico Design a long time ago. Uh, the German brand, and it's the self-striping, changing color mohair, silk mohair. Uh, so it's one ball, uh, but I, I don't know. One day I was uh, in a hotel sitting on the on the sunbed, and I just started to knit something. So I, in the round, I just knitted stockinette stitch. No. I just needed um, so in the round I just needed something <laughs> so it will be I'm giving to my mom and it will be a sort of double decorative shawl something like this I don't want to uh, um, frog it I, I, I we can keep it it's okay it's beautiful yarn so it can be used in this way very hot here i remove it i will show you i i will i will put the name because i don't have the tag anymore this is a long time ago i did it i will put the, the name of the uh, yarn and the picture of the yarn uh on the corner here um what i would like to show you what my uh, purchase was for this uh last few weeks and what makes me so happy but uh, uh also it's uh, i don't know i'm buying 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 yarn and i'm yes i'm knitting but it is taking a long time and i see my yarn my old sto storage here and i think oh i think i will need for the next three or four years or something anyway i will show you there is a i found this on the british website I will put the name here also, um, but the, this is, I think it's a German, German, uh, yes, German company, uh, Regia, Regia, for the self-striping yarns, and it's signated by um, Carlos and, uh, uh, Anna and Carlos, so they designed, they helped the Regia to design the, um, self-striping yarn and this for example will look like this here you can see Anna and Carlos and I will try to knit something me I never knit uh, socks as uh, maybe you know because you're already watching me for a few times or for the new people who are watching me for the first time today I don't like to I know I I like to knit socks but I don't need socks because here is very hot I I prefer to knit the garments the clothes the uh, shawls sha and hats for my family but now I have a, a big sack of yarn for socks I can need a lot of socks now because me I I didn't know that one of these balls is enough for two socks so I everywhere I bought two yarns two balls for the same sock so I will have now a lot of socks to knit and but I think they are beautiful so 
it's fine oh i will just make one and i will maybe give to a friend the another one i i don't know as a gift christmas gift uh, yeah um the another sokian which i bought is the opal it's 425 meters in uh, 100 gram it's also german uh, a german company but also from the british uh, website so here you can see the colors self striping here uh, so it's a few there, but I will not show you all of them, but um, yeah, it's also the opal. It will look like this, you can see on the picture. And uh, um, maybe, uh, and I got another brand, Drops. It's Fable, F Fable, Fable, Fable print. It is something like this. And I think here I will need two balls of this to make one pair of socks. Well, I have a green also. <laughs> I have a plenty of Sokian now. Um, yeah, but the, uh, I have also a dark blue, dark blue, also sig signated by uh, Carlos, uh, Anna and Carlos, and Regia again, where they're showing you, you see where to start. Also, they're showing you how to start with the yellow and with the yellow here. So you can do two socks at the same time because you can pull from inside and you can pull from outside uh, outside and inside and then you can go on with two different uh, different uh, uh, two socks at the same time so my collection of sockians now i have to start and for that i placed order by um i tried to need some uh on my Thick circular needles. Uh, I have a uh, small uh, needles like uh, one millimeter, one and a half, one seventy-five. I got a whole collection of uh, needles, and I tried to knit with two and a half uh, circular needle. But the circumstances of the circle of the of the the cable is still too big, so I can't really make uh, the sock uh, properly. So I, for that, I ordered a small, uh, the set of the small shorties from Chagu, uh, from Tripians, and they are on the way uh, from the uh, scaredness of um, eventually being uh, maybe in lockdown because of the COVID here. I paid a bigger amount of for shipping and uh, Nili from Tripians, she sent uh, by DHL so it's arriving it's arriving I think it's today in today on Saturday uh, should be here so um uh I will have my small me me needless uh, and um by, from Chagu which I like because I got the bigger blue set not the red set so now is the time for the red set where are the smaller sizes of the needles and I will try to knit the socks these socks very quickly let's see <laughs> oh my god it's a lot of a lot of lot of lot of socks so what is i can show you aha this i started here but this doesn't didn't work so well um well i bought more i mean i bought a lot of things but um yes there uh, was um uh for one day there was a, a extra discount on Fabulousian website. I will put the, the name exactly. I think it's Fabulousian. Yes. Yes. So that's the card from them. And um, they carry a lot of lot of uh, different brands. And I bought from them um, two of uh, Artian's Merino Cloud in colorway Baltic Sea. I also ordered one from, uh, because they didn't have more in stock, I also ordered one from Midi from Tripians, it's coming. So I'm planning to make a huge, uh, because there is um, uh, 400 meters in it, 437 yards. And I plan to make some uh, huge triangles bit half and half style uh, shawl for me i'm coming from uh, from poland and i was living 
three kilometers far away from the Baltic Sea. So I needed this color. I really needed this color and I needed, uh, there is also another parcel from uh, um, Fabulous Yarns coming, but I ordered uh, with a normal postage. It's still on somewhere, no idea where, in the world somewhere. So there is coming this, this color. Um, so I'm playing, but it's only one uh, yarn. So I'm planning to make from this three, which is also coming from the uh, Tricons, um, I'm planning to make a huge triangle uh, shawl and with this uh, pinkish color, I will make a border around. So it will be uh, my Baltic uh, sea and sundown um, shawl and it will be mine because I'm from this uh, era. Very nice, I love it. So it is Merino Cloud, it is 80% uh, extreme Merino, no, extra fine Merino wool and 20% cashmere. I like the, I like the softness. I did my half and half uh, wrap um, for Per Soho uh, Cal and I did it also with um, this 80% Merino and 20% cashmere. Um, one side uh, uh, mixed of yarns and it is really amazing feel and this is also just rich and warm and beautiful I will have a lot of fun with this I know the colors are mine and the uh, feel of yarn is mine so what I bought also from them uh, I bought also from Artians I like very much Artians um, I bought also from Artians. This is the 100% um, cashmere, Italian cashmere. It's in 50 grams, it's 450 meters. So in this is 450 meters and in this is 450 meters. So I have 900 very fine cashmere. Um, yeah, cashmere one is called the... the, the the one i know they have the ticket version also but uh this i took it i want to do something like kind of t-shirt like bit like uh, ranuclas but um maybe the love knot uh, or something in this way with these colors, I think it's my colors. I like very much yellow. I know you see a lot of yellow and a lot of pink in my in my works. So this is this is a, a cashmere from them. Then I bought also from them um, also from Artians Merino Cloud. The same combination: eighty percent uh, fine merino, twenty percent cashmere, and this is the colorway. I don't see the colorway here. I don't know. I will find out, but I will put it here. So this is a very, very nice also colors. I like it. This will be some, I think, pullover one day. With maybe dark blue or purpley cuffs and uh, some, or maybe, yeah, something like this. So one day, I'm not buying four project i'm buying for pleasure to have the yarn and later when i see some nice uh, pattern and i'm going to my stash and i'm checking yes this is the yarn for it the last yarn what i bought from the um, uh, fabulous yarns where they were offering this extra i think 10 percent of uh, on the price uh, it is ya a yarn from galerie yarns it's a prime alpaca and it is written that this alpaca lives 13,000 feet above sea level. So in Peru, so very interesting. Uh, this, this is um, 603 meters, 660 yards in this 227 grams. It's a huge skin of yarn and I have it two of them and here I'm planning to make beautiful beautiful pullover one color pullover maybe some um, how do you call it? Huh, 
now blackout. Um, so <laughs> I will, I will make some beautiful, beautiful pullover. Maybe with a, a higher a neckline here, a warm, big, and. I'm thinking and I'm thinking and I'm just stopping because I will redo. I'm thinking to make with this yarn some cozy, big, like maybe cardigan, long sleeves, uh, warm, uh, the neckline bit coming up, maybe something very, very cozy with bottoms, really something special. So this is the one, the yarn, Gale Yarns, Prime Alpaca Naturals, grown in Peru, 13,000 feet above the sea level. In Very interesting. So, uh, fabulous yarn were great for the sale. We, we got also, because of the amount I ordered, I got two packets, I, I just two packets of extra small bag. I, but I put it in one. I got some goodies. I got a bottom. I got a very mini skins of different yarns. Okay. There is a blue sky fibers. There is um, no idea, but it is a silver fox color yarn. There is um, Oats uh, yarns. This is uh, amazing and it's longer. This is again Blue Sky Fibers and this is some Merino. So this was the goodies plus the bottom. Very nice. Um, th thank you so much for the, for the goodies. And there was also a pattern. Pattern for a cow. Um, yeah, I will show you the picture. Oh, this paper is sorry, but the, you know, the transportation is cracking a bit. So, this there was a pattern in it also. This is just my shopping, and then what I did also, I bought a place order by Hasegawa because uh, while knitting this Ranyan Colossus, I was using my blue and green colors, light and blue and light green. Uh, and I went to the website and I ha got um, caught in the shopping again. Um, by I I took um, uh, this color, light pink. The silk is amazing in this. I Hasegawa is uh, known for very good silk, so silk and mohair is just amazing here. And then I got uh, another color. I think this is C29 Lilac. This is C25, no idea what that is written in Japanese. And then I have also a gray, light gray one. So this was the silk mohairs, what I got from Hasegawa. This is C18, smoke gray okay and then i i bought something different to try uh, the yard that i bought it is for a pullover uh, so i see what i will do later with it but it is very interesting because it's a uh, in both cases it's a silk tweed from them it's 100 percent silk but it's not at all shiny like silk is. Uh, you can see here the the yarn. It's like very matte. I mean, it's silk, but it is completely something different than we can see some... You know, silk is normally very... Sh giving the sheen and giving the softness. And this is quite roughish also in a, in a touch. And another one is um, from Hasegawa also. Uh, it's called Russell Tweed, Ra Russell Tweed. And uh, this one is C7 colorway, 
but it's also very different very very different it's a bit thicker but it's um it's uh looking more than wool and not uh, silk but it is written it's 100 percent silk so maybe you want to try something different than the normal uh, silk with the sheen and um yeah this is um uh, this is what i bought i also uh, was uh, placing um order with uh, um this is ranicolas and uh, shopping <laughs> podcast um I also placed order by um, uh, Hedgehog Fibers because they were offering the advent calendar. And as you can see, it's very shiny here. As you can see, the Hedgehog Fiber calendar is uh, advent calendar is here. It's it is waiting for me. I'm very passionate and I'm waiting. My kids also received already their own uh, advent calendars um, with some widget spinners. So they're also waiting. We're all waiting for Christmas. Tomorrow I will try to clean out the uh, house and I think on Sunday we will be, when the podcast will be up, I think we will be decorating already for Christmas. We are very fast here. In this hot climate, we want to feel Christmas a bit early because to just to give uh, us the uh, good feelings. So by uh, buying this uh, Hedgehog Fibers um, Advent Calendar, I realized I uh, to uh, fulfill the free of charge uh, international European international uh, shipment. Um, I need to buy more yarn. So I bought three skeins of different yarns I never was having. And this is um, sock yarn and it's a uh, full gold, 100, uh, 400 meter merino 90% and nylon. This is this color. So only one. Then I got the um, skinny singers, skinny singers. And this is 366 meters and 100% merino. It's, I like yellow. And um, then I got a uh, silk merino lace. I got two of them, but different colors. I One is downstairs already. It's uh, caked because I will, I need to make the uh, ranicolas for Christmas for my friends. So it's already downstairs in, in my, in my, in front of my bed and waiting for me to just to do some start but i need to finish some things for my sister and send it next week um so this is one of them the uh, merino silk uh, merino lace it is 700 meters um 50 percent silk 50 percent merino the same the another one the the caked one and i think i will help it um the the one which i have there this i don't know still what i will do but i will help it double to make uh, the merino, uh, the ranicolas looking nice, or I will make a single, and I will change the needle size to from six millimeters to four millimeters. I will make a small swatch, and I see my friend is small, tiny, and I think this um, will be fine for her, even with the smaller uh, neck here. When I will change the needle size to four millimeters, but I need to try out first. When not, then I will hold double and then I will make the normal normal size. So these are my purchases from, from Hedgehog Fibers, which I really, really like. I like my yarn. I like my yarn. I like my yarn. <laughs> shopping on yarn and my needles and so i'm waiting for more shipments coming and i placed my order also by for for per soho for my price which i won and it's it just arrived to my wishes so i think soon i will receive it so i will make small short uh, video about um per soho as thank you and um Kathy Jacks uh, needs uh, to say thank you again for the price. I will show you what I bought. And then I will talk a little bit more about 
Mauritius and new flowers which are just flowering right now and um, today I will not talk about Mauritius and some uh, interesting stuff because I think this podcast, podcast became a bit long and uh, and I'm hot <laughs> I always forget to say a uh, big thank you for watching me uh, watching the last uh, podcast I uh, like to say thank you for the beautiful comments on Instagram and on podcast and I would like to say to the new viewers thank you for watching maybe you would like to subscribe and um, be with me for the next one um, thank you my name is Anna on Instagram I'm Anna made with a smile on here I'm meeting in Mauritius and let me go back to my um, eating <laughs> to make my, more Nicolas to finish the one for my sister um ah, i have one more thing i wanted to show you i don't know where it is somewhere downstairs i think i will show this together with uh the purchase from persoho for my price because i will finish it and i will send it to my sisters so i think i will combine together thank you very much for watching i wish you all good health and that covid uh, don't catch you don't come to you don't knock to your doors and i hope everybody will be well and this crisis will finish soon smile neat make yourself happy make your family happy uh, care about yourself in these difficult times and be well Bye, thank you, do widzenia. Thank you, like, subscribe, enjoy your life, need, buy your yarn, smile.